So I'm here thinking, I'm painting this seeds and thinking about the rules for the seeds and you know how people talk about squash seeds and that they don't, that they cross pollinate and that you can um, use them as it save them, that you have to go with a company that they do different things to be sure that there's no cross pollination. Well, I planted about 12 plants originally, 12 squash and pumpkin plants. All of them got devoured by vine butters, squash vine butters, here in the South Baker. Terrific. So I decided to take some seeds from an acorn squash and plant them in the floor. So I planted those seeds from an acorn squash from the grocery store. And that plant survived. So from that plant, it was really, really late. From that plant, I got these babies. I haven't opened them yet, but I'm pretty sure they're edible. They're not acorn squash, but they survived. Try um, a lot of worms to get into them. Probably the pickle worm tried to get into them. And it was so hard. Plant died. They're hard. Still here. I'm going to try them soon and I will update you when that's an experiment. But the other two that I got are those two that are from a voluntary plant. So I didn't get, I don't know from what plant this is. I don't know what seeds got into the dirt and grew this too. So I'm thinking that the seeds that I'm saving from the squash will give me a good plant. Maybe, perhaps. I don't know if it's hybrid. I don't know what kind of plant they are. I'm also going to plant some other varieties next year, but then I'm going to plant this one. I am. I don't know if I'm a rebel or what, but the other two squashes um, make me think that perhaps I can get some harvest next year. What do you think? Should I use these seeds? There are many. Maybe they work. Is it the kusha squash? Really, really good. So let's see. Let me know what you think. Talk to you next time. Bye.